the recording, yes it is. Uh, what a miserable day. Uh, we all gather over there, shops. That's the locals here, and a few of the few of the other locals around here, including that character on the scooter who comes down from a court up there. And uh, I stay away from them. And today I sat on the other side having a smoke with my cousin Margaret, my uncle Arthur's daughter. I said, Why don't you sit with the others? And I told her, I won't name him, this character on the scooter, a big ignorant slob, threatened twice to put me in hospital. The last trivial incident. I pulled up over there and there were breadcrumbs all over the place. I said, who's chucked them down there? He says, I have. Why? I said, well, you're not supposed to, you know. He says, I fucking warned you, you're going to end up in hospital. I said, yeah, you'll end up in prison. Andrew said, I'll fucking kill him. I said, you won't. Keep out of it, Andrew. And what happened? That character ended up in hospital. <laughs> yeah. What goes around comes around. You can't go around threatening to put people in hospital and get away with it. So now I take great delight in ignoring him. Yeah, of course they must feel a bit embarrassed. What was the first trivial incident? I can't remember. But you can't go around threatening to put people in hospital, can you? On the weeping willows nice over there. I thought we had one at the back here, I said to somebody. The tree at the back was a lovely weeping willow. They said, of course it's not, you idiot. I can't remember what they said it was, but I don't know. As well as not being able to tell a weed from a plant, I'm not very good at recognising what trees are, but I do know that over there, pretty certain is a weeping willow, isn't it? Yeah, so going back to the last video, Something the mayor pointed out. I'm getting very, very bad on my feet. Hang on. It's a video, and I, I'll find the original photograph. Let me pause the video. How far has it gone? Oh, it's just finished. Right, pause. Who at the back? holding the cup. Her shadow is at the back, look. You see the cup? Yet yeah, the cup is in front of her. That is a very good point. And what's that on the wall behind him? Hey, Somebody said they saw something on the wall behind him. I don't know. What do you think? Him in the wheelchair, and there was a gap between him in the wheelchair and him. Now, why figures there? If I, I'll, I'll find the uh, original photograph and post it, and you can copy it, enlarge it, and you'll see that that figure, that white figure, is sat. I don't think you can see on that. It's at an old wooden stool. She's shown her ass. It is a woman, I think. I don't know the figure next to her. And the lady that bought the farmhouse, she took the photograph. Then took it back to the shop to my pharmacist friend, my chemist friend John, and said, What's that white figure? And as I said to the mayor, John's not got Photoshop, he wouldn't know what to do with it anyway. And she got the negatives with it. I said, why didn't you do a copy off the fucking negatives? I'm sorry, Arthur, I didn't think. I said, you idiot. All right, Arthur, don't give me a hard time, he said. <laughs> so very interesting. And the mayor has pointed that out. That's very interesting. How can that be? A shadow behind her and you can see the cup. I don't know. 
But anyway, I know if you did. Would you believe? I have been out, I'm not going out again. Because I've been having a nap. And I might go on might go online to China later. Once again, all the best. Bye.